Hello, and don't you want to look young and beautiful forever? Well, hi, my name's Katie, and I have this channel called Katie's Truth Awakening Journey, where I talk to you about the truths that are here on the planet. It's not my fault if you get triggered. It's just my job to get you going. <laughs> so I'm gonna talk to you about health a bit. So, you know, imagine our soul. Our soul, is from the stars, right? And then we get put into this body and our body is made of like over 70% water. And then we have just the rest of our parts, which are, you know, natural. So we need to eat fruits and vegetables to keep our body parts moving, to keep our skin tight, to keep this aging process from not happening. Did you know white cane sugar is more addicting than cocaine. It's eight times more addicting than cocaine. I've said it before, but it's true. The moment you have like a sugary product or something, it's great or whatever, but then like maybe an hour later, you're gonna be hungry again <laughs> because your body has that sugar in its system and it's craving it. If you wanna eat bad foods, let's say like a pizza or a hamburger or McDonald's, um, <laughs> <laughs> the best thing to do, or at least I like to do it, is put a buttload of veggies on there. If you're gonna eat, a, if you're gonna eat bad food, just shove a bunch of spinach in your mouth. Just shove some kale in your mouth while you're eating those products. You might be like, ew, but you know what? It, you can barely taste it with the tons of fat <laughs> that are in other things. Why is this important? Because when you eat the vegetables with the fatty foods, the vegetables are gonna help break it up so you can digest it better and you are gonna feel better. You're not gonna feel so sluggish because you're gonna have that extra food to help break it down. Why do we feel sluggish when we eat those kind of foods? It's because our body now has to take more time to process those foods because they are harder to process. And without the fruits and vegetables in there to help, it takes energy from us, so that's why we feel sluggish, right? Um, what's also good about not having white cane sugar, and I'm also gonna say alcohol, and I'm gonna say soda. If you take those out of your diet, not only will your skin look beautiful, but you know, you're gonna feel better, and you're gonna be skinnier, because you're not gonna have all that extra weight. If you want to look your best, if you want to live a long life, the best thing to do is to take care of your diet. What you put in yourself makes everything else matter. Because if you don't feel good inside, how do you expect to live your dreams and to do the things you want to do? It's about the inner strength. It takes time and practice to build these habits. But you can do it. I can do it too. I didn't always used to be this way. I grew up in a home where we ate carbs and cheese all the time. We didn't know that we were gluten intolerant or lactose for better words. So pretty much everything got clogged up. I was fat, I was not pretty, I didn't like the way I looked, I didn't like anything about myself because I didn't understand that what I put in my mouth affects the rest of everything. So I just kind of wanted to put that out there for you that know you can change your life. You can change your health by just simple, just changing simple things. Like if you drink soda, stop drinking soda. You know, not eating right before bed is a huge part of being able to have a healthy metabolism and to not gain weight. If you want to just lose weight, <laughs> don't eat past 630. And when you wake up, make sure you drink a bunch of water. And if you can have a smoothie, that's going to help you to get your digestive system clean and happy. There's all these little tips that you can find. But I wanted to share you these, these tips that have always helped me. And because I am now living this lifestyle of no cane sugar or very, very tiny and just eating fruits and vegetables and foods that um, fit my diet, um, I'm, I'm happier and I can also help people. If you want help, I can help you on a coaching side. I have ADHD, so you know, that's, if you have ADHD, I can definitely help you because we can relate. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. 
you are a bright shining star and if you want to change your life you can no one has to tell you otherwise if you're in a family that's toxic you can be the change in your family you can be the reason why your family changes as well know that you are worthy of everything that you want in your mind have a great day